Hello guys and girls, welcome back to my channel. It's Snow Bluebell right here and we're going to continue our journey of men and Madden. Yes, men of Madden. And we're going to understand uh, what those people want. Um, so the last video, the boat um well had a storm and the boat um crashed to an old ship that we saw in the first video in the first chapter so we're gonna see what is going to happen to them let's continue Please put a big thumbs up. <laughs> okay, then. We will turn to the Bard for inspiration. The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 7. The Prince of Morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads, All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress i presume you're eager to get back to your story but here's a thing everything may not be entirely as it seems <sighs> probably shouldn't have said that okay so, uh, so he gave us a tip i mean um He give us a clue of what's going in here. La porte! La porte! Oh, okay, so the boat is good. Junior, you retire la tête à l'image. <laughs> Go. If I remember in the first chapter there was some suspicious suspicious things uh, happening in this old ship. Jesus. Go on, keep moving. Who am I controlling? Uh, I'm controlling Les. C'est un foutu cimetière. J'espère qu'on est les seuls ici. Oh là là. Over there. Um, they are talking uh, French. What's this? Hey. Come on, man. I wanted to see it. Whole place is a floating death trap. Keep moving. Come down. Oh, is this? It looks like a person in there. Oh. 
she lost her bracelet, I think. Uh oh. Get back. <gasps> the Mask of Madness. I did not sign up for a trip to Creep Town. Miller? Who's Miller? What are these guys gonna do with us now? Ah, oh, merde! a rat calm down okay we have some clue here pick it internal memorandum again this is the third time this week none of us like it down there Maybe Patterson should just buck up. Just get on it. Let me see how many... Okay, let me see this. Conrad rushed for the speedboat during the kidnapping. Conrad started the speedboat and made a break for it. Danny brought Alex on deck with a knife to his throat. With, with Olson about to fire at Conrad, Alex attacked Olson. Allowing Conrad to easily avoid Olsen's shots. Alex took, took the, bands, the bank stick on the dive. Julia used the bank stick to open the door to the cockpit. Uh, yes, yes, this is the same thing. Oh, proposal, yeah. Brad told Alex to follow his gut. So Alex proposed to Julia. Julia said yes. Alex and Julia announced their engagement to the others. When they talked about it later, they were both happy. The, fi the fisherman took Julia's engagement ring. Julia wanted, waited to decompress before surfacing. Secrets. We found three so far guard duty note flight plan and missing lifeboat and three pictures of um, I mean uh, three um, promenations future of possible futures Olsen, you're in port to see Okay, all of you, into the room. Hey, it's piss black in here. Give us the light. Peut-être qu'on doit pas leur donner quelque chose. Oh. So guys, if you are enjoying this video, please put a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. You still with us, Captain? Sorry, man, I just missed the button.
as I was saying, please subscribe to my channel and click on all notifications to not miss any video on my channel. Please comment down below um, what you guys think about it and share with your friends. Let's continue. What the hell is this fucking place? Uh, for boating. It has to have something to do with the Manchurian gold. We're not far from those coordinates. Maybe this is the ship that was carrying the gold? Guess it's a possibility. We can't just sit around. We need a plan. Let's get back to our boat, get the hell away from here, and never step foot off dry land again. How's that for a plan? I saw one of the goons take something out of the boat. Distributor cap. Makes the engine work. The Duke of Milan is a floating brick without it. We need to get it back. While those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. Fliss, I just wanted to say that, um, I might have gotten things kind of wrong back there. Uh, excuse me? I may have kind of prematurely come to the conclusion that maybe, you know, you're working some kind of side deal with these guys or whatever. But I, I mean, obviously that's not true. They're being just as bad to you as they are to us. So, yeah. Allow me to translate. He's saying that he's sorry. Well, I... Hmm. Well, your apology is kinda accepted. Cool. Cool. Who am I controlling now? Oh, Fliss. Ooh, this glasses. Is very strange. What do you think this ship was? Okay, um... Alex? I'm really scared. We all are. Okay. Um... Let's see... Hi baby doll, I miss you like crazy. Three months until my next leave. And jumping into your arms three months I've been on some shore leave with with the guys had a few beers but don't worry I'm keeping everything ready for you if you can if you catch my drifts how's work I hope that boss of yours is leaving you alone I know you can take care of yourself but I feel I uh, feel helpless being so far away, and I want to keep you safe. This guy, Miller? That seems pretty spooked. I get a lot of time to think while I'm guarding the cargo holds. It's dark and spooky down there. Some of the other guys have seen a figure roaming around. But I've always got you with me to keep me safe too. I will be with you soon and get a job as a mechanic and we can get married and have two children. We'll be happy f together forever. Love you so much, Miller. And the kiss. Ship mascot. An I wonder old why they all left it behind. American overseas gangland. Archaeologists missing in Iraq, 24 British 
archaeologists have gone missing in the Zagros Mountains of Iraq. The Hodgson expedition arrived in the kingdom in September last year with the stated goal of un unearthing the... We can't see the rest of it. This letter that was never sent. Okay. Well, it said there were rumors about figures roaming around the cargo. Figures? You want to be more specific? Uh, troubled. Look, I'm not really sure what he meant. All I know is that I just get this really creepy feeling like something terrible happened here. Something is wrong. I don't like it. I don't like a single thing about this place. Not at all. I found this note. It was back in the bunk room. So it says that this guy... Patterson? Kept playing sick, getting out of guard duty when he was supposed to be in the hold. Hmm. I guess he did it like a bunch of times. Anyways, it, it doesn't seem like anyone liked it too much down there. So what I'm gathering is the crew... Man, they were pretty creeped out by whatever the hell they were carrying on this ship. I just wish I knew what the fishermen were planning. Serious. Back on the Duke, I overheard them talking about the Manchurian gold. <laughs> I really don't think they had any of this planned until the gold caught their attention. We need to watch them closely. This could go from bad to worse if they don't find what they're looking for. So, what do we do? Lively. Look, we need to either find a way out of this room, or we need to be ready to make a move when those fishermen come back. Okay, well, we're not gonna do anything from in here. We need to keep looking around and try to find a way out. Just be careful. Stripped. Not gonna work that way. What do you think? I can't get it open. Over here. Maybe we can bend it open and get out of here. Confident. Yeah. This is the way out. You want me to just smash through this wall? Oh yeah, sure. Big man on campus. Someone should create a distraction. This is gonna be loud. Sure, I agree. Fliss, wanna do the honors? Barricade. Hey, hey. 
Can I get some help with this? Jeez, maybe the... Well, it looks like washing machines from that century. It's just so weird that they all just vanished. It's like they were just snapped up right in the middle of whatever they were doing. You guys saw that? I, I I saw someone in here. Dear Ailes, I'm finally coming home. This is it. Dar this is it, darling. One last trip across the Pacific, and I'll be back to you and the girls. I can't wait to see your faces. Tell Ned and Nancy to get excited. They're gonna see Daddy real soon, and he's got a gift for, for all. I'm sure, gl I'm sure glad to be back at sea. It's hotter than an Oklahoma summer out here on land, and there's no escape from it. I've been alright because I got your, your letters to keep me going. They censored them, which is probably for the best, because sometimes the others steal them to read, and I don't like them reading our letters, I know. Really creeps me out. He keeps telling me there's a little boy on board, and it sounds like Ted. I know he's just messing with me. <clears throat> there ain't no way we got a stowaway. 
our ops. Guys are far too slick now, the war is over. I bet they'll edit this bit out. But it shows what a place can do to a guy. I gotta go for now, honey. There's some commotion outside. That usually means I'm about to be really busy for a while. I'll write again soon, Robert. Jesus, what's next? resourceful when he puts his mind to it. That's not really an answer. Well, then, sure. I think Conrad's made it. Oh, great. You hear that? Yep. Big boat, big engine. book oh it's a diary June 19 19 I identified problem areas with structural brightness and cracks in some sections of cargo hold one I instructed our shipwright to carry out the necessary weldings repairs I advise the captain to go easy, especially in bad weather. Any aggressive movement could cause the ship to break its back. June <coughs> sorry. June 20. I responded to a complaint that some electronic equipment had been malfunctioning recently. I discovered growth of tin whisker whiskers around some of the components. I cleaned and added lead to the soldiers, which has stopped the equipment shorting out and should slow down the growth. June 31. I conduct a Torov weekly in Jane, room inspection of fuel. Okay, so basically... Um, They're talking about complaints of the clients, of the militaries here, and some electronic equipment uh, didn't work as expected. Another book. I'm not going to read all of this.
a premonition of Alex death Son! got blood on his shirt. Okay. Qui est là? Je vous ai entendu. Qui est là? Arrête de crier, j'essaie d'entendre ce qui se passe. Je crie pas. Ta gueule. Je veux savoir où sont les autres. guys so this was the video hope you guys really really enjoy it and we'll see you in the next video so bye